Hello and welcome back to the channel. Um, in this video, I want to share this absolutely stunning bird with you all. Yes, this bird is real and the bird is beautiful. It is an absolutely beautiful bird. It's kind of funny looking too. Got those funny looking eyes or whatever. But if you take a closer look at those eyes, those eyes have something that a lot of women covet. Um, some of the pictures you can see it a lot more clear than others, but uh, this is called uh, a secretary bird, okay? Um, there are other names for the bird as well, and I'm going to share that with you in just a moment here, but there, there's the picture right there. You see those eyelashes? Aren't those eyelashes <laughs> funny? It's funny because you know a lot of women are going out buying stuff that looks just like it, and this secretary bird has it by default. They're, bur they're born with it. Look at that. That's just kind of funny to me. Um, anyway, I'm going to share some more details with you about this beautiful bird. I just wanted to start the morning off with something uh, different because when I first saw the images of this bird, I was like, is that one of those um, satire or uh, drafted pictures that they do? One of those, you know, uh, photoshopped images? That's what I thought immediately. I didn't think it was, I, well, I didn't know. It's not that I didn't think, I just didn't know that this was a real bird. But of course, this beauty is out of Africa. Yes, she is. So here are here are some additional uh, details on this beautiful bird. And um, I'll be right back after that. The secretary bird, Sagittarius serpentarius, is a large, mostly terrestrial bird of prey. Endemic to Africa, it is usually found in the open grasslands and savanna of the sub-Saharan region. John Frederick Miller described the species in 1779. Although a member of the order Accipitriformes, which also includes many other diurnal birds of prey such as kites, hawks, vultures, and harriers, it is placed in its own family, Sagittariidae. The secretary bird is instantly recognizable as a very large bird with an eagle-like body on crane-like legs that give the bird a height of as much as 1.3 meters, 4 feet 3 in. The sexes are similar in appearance. Adults have a featherless red-orange face and predominantly gray plumage, with a flattened dark crest and black flight feathers and thighs. Breeding can take place at any time of year, but tends to be late in the dry season. The nest is built at the top of a thorny tree, and a clutch of one to three eggs is laid. In years with plentiful food all three young can survive to fledging. The secretary bird hunts and catches prey on the ground, often stomping on victims to kill them. Insects and small vertebrates make up its diet. Although the secretary bird occurs over a large range, the results of localized surveys suggest that the total population is experiencing a rapid decline, probably as a result of habitat degradation. The species is therefore classed as endangered by the International Union for Conservation of Nature. The secretary bird appears on the coats of arms of Sudan and South Africa. It is instantly recognizable as a very large terrestrial bird with an eagle-like head and body on crane-like legs. The neck is not especially long, and can only be lowered down to the intertarsal joint, so birds must stoop to reach down to the ground. During flight, two elongated central feathers of the tail extend beyond the feet, and the neck stretches out like a stork. The plumage of the crown, upper parts, and lesser and median wing covers is blue-gray, and the underparts and underwing covers are lighter gray to gray-white. The crest is made up of long black feathers arising from the nape. The scapulars, primary and secondary flight feathers, rump and thighs are black, while the upper tail covers are white, though barred with black in some individuals. The tail is wedge-shaped with white tipping, marbled gray and black coloring at the base, and two broad black bands, one at the base and the other at the end. Sexes resemble one another, although the male tends to have longer tail feathers, more head plumes, a shorter head and more blue-gray plumage. Adults have a featherless red-orange face with pale brown irises and a yellow sear. The legs and feet are pinkish-gray, the upper legs clad in black feathers. The toes are short, around 20% of the length of those of an eagle of the same size, and stout, so that the bird is unable to grasp objects with its feet. The rear toe is small and the three forward-facing toes are connected at the base by a small web. Immature birds have yellow rather than orange bare skin on their faces, more brownish plumage, shorter tail feathers and grayish rather than brown irises. 
Okay, so I don't have too much more to say on this beautiful bird, but I did think it was inter interesting that this bird with such beautiful eyelashes stumps out its prey. When it catches something that's ready to eat, it stumps it out. Ain't that something, y'all? Uh, anyway, I am done with this video. In the comment section below, share your thoughts. Just remember, keep it tight and keep it right. And with that, I'm out. We hope you liked today's topic. Please leave your comments below. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, share and like this video. And with that, we're out. Be sure to ring the bell to be notified of new uploads on this channel. And also, comment, share, like, and subscribe.